G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video review. Today we're going to be having a look at the 6 inch Pop Hero or the Pop Vinyl uh, Marvel figure Thanos from the Guardians of the Galaxy. He's number 78 in the collection and uh, as you can see there his head's wobbling. But uh, before we have a quick look at him, let's have a quick look at the box. So as usual, we've got the Pop Figure boxes there. You've got number 78, and the Pop and the Marvel and then the Thanos figure with the evil smile. It's got Thanos final bobblehead and then it's uh, written in a couple of different languages. Then on the side there, you've got number 78 with Thanos. And then on the back, you've got the, uh, the other Guardians of the Galaxy figures. See if I can focus that for you there. So you've got Ronan, Yondu, uh, Dancing Groot, Nebula, the Collector, and then the larger-than-life Thanos. So collect them all, as they uh, encourage you to do all the time. So there's the box there. As I said, he's a six-inch figure. So uh, a lot bigger than your stock standard box. I'll put it next to the... Um, Hulk box that you saw from the Avengers set, or we can see from the Avengers set, and uh, well and truly during the size of the figure, he is definitely bigger. So let's have a look at him. So you can see here quite imposing the uh, the stance that they've got him in with the fists clenched, and then he's uh, quite uh, well detailed with his um, gold and blue, and then you've got the head there, quite a large head, but the bobble's quite nice on the head, keeps him up nice and tall. And tall. He looks uh, a little bit. Uh, too happy in my opinion, but uh, I suppose when you're Thanos, you can uh, do whatever you like. So you've got the detail there on the top of the skull. So pretty much based on the outfit that we see in the Guardians of the Galaxy movie, as well as towards the end of Avengers 2. Sorry for the spoiler if you haven't seen that already, but uh, I think by now everybody's seen the Avengers movie. Zipping in there, pretty much his colouring is limited to the, uh, the gold and the blue. There's uh, a little hint uh, a shade change, but that's about it. And then on the bottom, you've just got the, uh, the official stuff there from Marvel. So as I said, a quick review. Hope that uh, if you're thinking of adding him to your collection, that's given you enough to tip you either the line or decide whether or not to leave him on the shelf. But uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Keep subscribing and uh, hang out for... Um, I'm doing a review on the collector's exclusive um, Hulkbuster Iron Man, as well as the Glow in the Dark. Hulk. So stay around for those ones. Anyway, thanks for watching. Keep subscribing. Cheers.